it says Crunch Shop 7, we're going to see if I get the ticket. Cool. And nothing. But now suddenly you can see that laser way better because it's bouncing off all those little particles in the air. But what I want to point out here is whatever angle the laser comes in on the mirror, if I'm at a shallow angle like this, or maybe I go to a 45 degree angle, it bounces off at the same angle. Now I'll go all the way up here really steep, perpendicular to the mirror, and it bounces off and it hits itself. And that works not only vertically, but horizontally. My grandma had a situation where, and maybe you've seen this too, where you have two mirrors like this and they face each other, and you sort of get that infinity effect. I'm gonna sort of fake it here by putting these two mirrors like this. And so what's happening now is these light rays are coming in here and it's going back and forth, back and forth. And there's loss, right? Because they're hitting little particulates in the air. The glass kind of diffuses them. So it doesn't go infinitely, but you know, you put your fingers in like this. Then if I take my phone and sort of film it as I do that, you can see my fingers come down and there's just like a seemingly infinite number of my fingers performing oh, in your crazy. It's really So if you take your fingernail and you touch the mirror, and your fingernail touches your fingernail perfectly, well then you probably should wait for the person on the other side, because you're not standing in front of a normal mirror. Okay, so now we cover how to put it Can together. I go try that real quick? You can follow along with the visual. I'll try to do this. Right there. Right there. Oh, okay. I, uh, it's not touching. Nothing on the other side. What the heck? What the? Where'd it go? It really does jump out perfectly. So, so, Decker, mm -hmm. it's been a day mm -hmm. since the build. What'd you think of the build? Wait, what was the build? It was, um, bank box or? Mirror bank. Mirror bank. What was the, uh, concept? Um, Mirrors. A reflection. Uh, what were the uh, things on the board? Uh, in cave, or cave-in, or concave, and conflection? Close, convex. Convex. With a V, V, V. What was the difference in them? What's the differences? Um, so convex, you can see, like, wide, and it's, like, round. And then, if in con, 
concave. So no, what are some things in the world that are concave? Um, a satellite dish. How does that work? So there's a stick in that part where that little dot would be. What's that and little dot? Do you remember stick. what that little dot's called? Focal point. Focal point. What's happening? Like what's happening in that little dot? What's happening? All the light comes in. All the light comes into the and it reflects. And it reflects all onto the that point. Focal point, yeah. Focal point. Yeah, you got it. And so that that's like uh, extra strong. If it was sunlight, like Mark Rober said, he burnt himself. Remember? Yeah. Burnt, but uh, if it's if it's just like a signal, like a, a t television signal or something, satellite signal or something, it's most strong at that point. That's why the satellite dish has that little arm and it holds a little sensor out there. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, and then, yeah. Um, what do you think of the build? What, what's, your what's your favorite part of it? Uh, pointing the coin so siblings can't steal your money. <laughs> so it looks empty. Yeah. That's your favorite part of it? Is that, that your money's really there, but it looks empty? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. I like the spider, I have to admit. Yeah. Uh, the way he jumps uh, is very immediate. Uh -huh. Very immediate. He's up on you quick. Uh -huh. All right. All right. Cool.